Welcome to the Komori Connection. This series of informative videos will allow Komori to stay connected to you, our customer. Throughout this series, the Komori team will be introducing the latest in Komori Press technology. Today you'll see how Komori's Analox Coder takes automation to a new level. Hi, my name is Doug Shart. I'm Director of Product Management here at Komori America Corporation. I'm standing on the, the Komori GL540 with Coder. I'm with Chris Ownby, our demonstrator here, and we'd like to show you some of the features on the Komori coding system today. So the Komori coding system is loaded with features that'll help both in speed of change and in accuracy. We'll start with the feature list of just showing you how a play changes. Um, the, the coder is actually part of the automatic play changing process. It's sequenced together. So what you're hearing now with music is the cycle of the press going to the semi-automatic coder play change here. You're hearing the clamps open up automatically and the cylinder is going to rotate to the right position. And then Chris is actually going to show you how we change a plate automatically. So we'll let him talk, talk to you about some of the features he's going to see as he goes through the change. So as Doug mentioned, the press has automatically positioned itself for me to remove the blanket from the tail clamp. Once I remove the tail of the blanket from the clamp, I actuate the button here and the press will automatically move to the next position. Uh, I also want to mention that as I'm guiding this blanket out of the press, this pressure roller is engaged, which helps guide the blanket safely out of the press. When the press is in the position for the lead edge clamp, the lead edge clamp opens automatically. I just take the old blanket out of the lead edge clamp and insert the new blanket into the clamp. The press will now position, go to the correct position and close the lead edge clamp. Today I'm using uh, pre-barred blankets. Uh, this system also can use uh, straight cut blankets, pre-punched straight cut blankets for uh, tight register type of work. There are retractable register pins in the clamp to accommodate the punched uh, plates. And now the, the clamp is locked up, I just let the press roll the, the new blanket in. And again, the pressure roller comes into play here. It's going to engage and uh, hold that blanket against the cylinder so it goes in nice and straight and smooth. And once the press is in the right position, I just tuck the tail, uh, tail edge of the blanket into the clamp. and. Clamp locks up and I'm done. So, so this plate change is done. Now the press will automatically sequence to the print units and change the litho plates for the for the next job. And incidentally, um, the coder on a Komori has full register controls from the console. We, we can adjust it laterally, circumferentially, even skewing. We can do it all from the console just like we can with the print unit. So another nice design feature of the Komori Press with respect to the coder is whether you're UV coating or aqueous coating, as the sheet comes off this impression cylinder, which is the coating impression cylinder, there's no delivery cylinder we have to worry about that sheet encountering before it transitions into the extended delivery for drying or curing. There's nothing it can hit, so you, you really don't have to worry about marks or scratches or, or anything caused by that delivery cylinder. It's a shellless cylinder. She will come off, go right into the air pans, and you're off to the races. Sometimes coders are the slowest part of a make ready, because uh, usually they're not part of a LinkedIn process of automation. Well, with Komori, we do link it in. And part of that automation link with a coder is the wash-up systems. So we've got full cylinder washes on this coder, uh, like we do on all coders, and all the impression cylinder washers on the press are located underneath the impression cylinder so that on a print unit we can actually put a UV light in that unit but down here the impression cylinder washer for the coder is a solvent impregnated cloth roll so it's already got the solvent in it we're not spraying solvent we're uh, not wasting solvent it's exactly what you need and we do have a water wash for an assist that's all programmable back at the console over on this side of the coder unit we have an automatic blanket washer, 
and that particular system uh, sprays water. It's not a, it's not a pre-sew cloth. It's actually spraying onto the cloth so we can get a little bit more, a little bit less, depending on the coating we, we're using. We can get into some of the corners and recesses on a raised plate. And Chris will show you in a minute how the, uh, actually the Analox roller is automatically washed up as well. I'd like to talk real quick about how I wash up the coder on the Komori Press. It's an automatic function that I start at the control panel here. Uh, whichever type of coating I'm running, I have an automatic function available, whether it's UV coating or aqueous coating. If I'm running UV coating, uh, this system is going to run solvent through, through, the, through the hoses and chamber to wash up the system and clean the roller off. If I'm running aqueous coating, it's going to run hot water through the system. But either way, whichever one I'm running, it's a simple matter of just selecting the wash up button here and then confirming by pushing this button here, and that's it. And once that program finishes running, uh, in this case, it would run, uh, I, have, I have the ability to select the length of the wash program. Right now, it's set for a four minute, 20 second wash. But during that wash process, basically, uh, valves are open and closed to stop the supply of coating to the press, and, uh, Valves are open to uh, start uh, pumping the fresh water up to the unit. And while this is happening, the, coat, the chamber is engaged, the roller is turning. And uh, so the chamber gets clean, the roller gets clean, the hoses are clean, the pan is clean, all automatically. 